The animal has been unleashed. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 290 pounds, the animal, Batista! Don't judge a book by its cover. He has an extremely high in-ring IQ on top of being an absolute powerhouse. Understandable as a man who sat beneath the learning tree of legends like Rey Mysterio and Triple H. He needs a high level of execution against the game. You're right, there is zero room for error. He must wrestle a perfect match. The game has arrived. The cerebral assassin ready to engage in warfare. This is gonna be good. Decade we have seen this man's dominance grow from a blue blood to a degenerate to a multiple time WWE champion. Indeed, Triple H has solidified himself at the top of the food chain in WWE, and he has no plans on stepping down anytime soon. And I don't think anyone can take him down. From Degeneration X to Evolution, we have seen Triple H amass power in WWE, cultivating strength in numbers. But there's no more room under the learning tree of the Cerebral Assassin. Now he's all about earning the gold and glory for himself. Indeed, the game has never been more dangerous. Guys, this one has plenty of history behind it. Triple H versus Batista, Mentor versus Mentee. Batista has said before that everything he knows he's learned from the likes of Triple H. It should be interesting to see if there's some tricks the game kept up his sleeves all this time. I can guarantee you, Cole, Triple H may have taught Batista all that he knows in this business, but he didn't teach Batista everything that he himself knows. This should be an absolute clinic if emotions don't get too out of hand. He is going to take this match as long and as far as he needs to. Getting set up for something in the corner. Oh, vicious shoulder tackle in the corner. She's getting something from under the ring. Connecting with a sharp elbow. 
face wash. And that attack could have Triple H questioning whether he can still hang. Seeing some no-nonsense offense from Batista. Setting up for something here. From the ring all the way to the floor. And it has got to be demoralizing just being tossed outside the ring like that. Oh, they can worry about their feelings later. Right now, they're making sure every bone's still in place. Oh, she's removing the turnbuckle pad. Come on, this isn't right. Batista's taking control. Say it however you want. Batista is just manhandling Triple H. Corey, Triple H is, of course, known as the cerebral assassin. Is it wise to try to outwit a competitor like him? The competition shouldn't so much as try to outwit or outplay the game, but instead just be patient. Don't try to come for the king and possibly miss. Let the king come to you and take your moment. Suplex right onto the apron. Hitting the edge right in front of the referee. That'll be a blatant disqualification. Here we go with the man they call the game, Triple H. If it really is all about the game and how you play it, then nobody plays it better than Triple H. You got that right, Cole. That drive to achieve greatness has forged him into one of the shrewdest and most intelligent competitors we've ever seen here in WWE. And no doubt the game already has his first few moves for achieving victory planned out in this match. But it would be only natural for any man to be a little less sure of himself standing opposite Batista. A man six foot six, 290 pounds of pure aggression. Well, the man likes to ask if he has your attention now. If he doesn't have his opponent's attention, well, safe to say, He'll have it soon. Brilliant countering by both competitors. Oh, she has bad intentions now. Removing the turnbuckle pad. Military press. Ooh. Triple H facing a beatdown. Say it however you want. Batista is just manhandling Triple H. He went right into that turnbuckle. Oh, sent flying. I've seen Saxon thrown out of a few local bars like that before. Oh, please don't remind me, Corey. Batista has always relied on his tremendous strength. Corey, will that be enough to get the job done tonight? Well, many say that's why Batista dominated WWE, but he's developed new tools to supplement that strength. Tonight, he should mix his power with his MMA background, which will add even more devastation to his joint and limb manipulation. Uh-oh. Right into the ring post. What impact. Batista is out of his cage. This is exactly what I was talking about. That's Batista being a ferocious animal and a methodical mixed martial artist. From the apron... Great counter. Triple H reversing the momentum on him. That could be the trigger for Triple H to battle his way back into this. Into the chop block, a debilitating counter there. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Oh, driven face first into the apron. A collision like that could mark a turning point for this entire match. And now thrown back into the ring. Perhaps looking for some kind of equalizer here. Looks like she's opting to go with the old classic, a steel chair. Two, kick out. How in the world did he kick out? Caught with a DDT. Triple H getting dismantled here. Triple H needs to dig deep like he's done so often before. Batista looking to dissect Triple H. And Batista gets warded off. Spinning side slam. Kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. Triple H did his homework. Time to play the game. Big 
Swanton clothesline. Good grief. He has to be at his limit now. Yeah, this is a dire situation right now. Front face lock applied. It's about to get more painful. Hung across the top rope. Placed into the corner. Ah, oh, flipping the script on him there. Counters on counters. Technical prowess on display. Oh, she's removing the turnbuckle pad. Come on, this isn't right. She heads out of the ring, but she needs to pay attention to the ref's count. Compromised position here. Up and over. And Batista is revving this crowd up. Uh-oh, captured, driven into the knee. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Taking a trip outside, but he's got to be mindful of the count. Stiff elbow will break that up. Start counting, Saxton. One, two, three. We could be here all day. I think you're right. Oh, I didn't know you could count that high, Saxton. Shut up, Corey. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Finds the advantage after a string of counters. Kick to the midsection prevents the attack. Reversal from Batista. Batista! Batista bomb! Batista didn't waste time. That's gotta be it. There's two! Oh, not yet. They just got the shoulder up. Unbelievable resilience and resolve from Triple H. The game is still in this. Kicking out of that is only going to piss off Batista even more, and that's not something I'd recommend. Producing consecutive attacks. This is frightening strength here. Effective use of the knee. Looking vulnerable on that top turnbuckle. Up top, look at the power here. Incredible. That was ridiculous. Batista. Batista by submission. This is no game. Batista did it. What a huge win. Now let's take another look at these guys in action. beat Triple H, Byron. Well, Batista withstood every attack and unleashed his power at the right time.